It's time to fire this thing up. Hit it. About an hour ago, I sent Bert and Hunter underneath the barn in order to pull out our 22-foot crest pontoon boat. And good deal you made it. Hi, I'm John Graviscus. It's great to have you back around the craft. Last fall, we built a really cool winter cover for this boat out of a product called SureLab from Glen Raven Mills, and it really did a magnificent job. I could not believe when I was washing the cover off how much dirt Spider webs, leaves, I mean, it was everywhere. It's not in the boat. I mean, that's why you want a winter cover. Now, this winter cover, uh, the engineering on it is really cool. We have a big center beam. You kind of pick that up and you set it off. And we have four different forms that kind of look like a manger. And we kind of remove those from the boat. But I want to tell everybody about the dangers of the extreme temperature changes that you might have if you have a lake home up in the mountains or something like we do. Okay, this last winter, apparently the frost went seven feet down into the ground. It was brutal. And my deck on this boat really kind of took a beating and I want to point out some different areas. Do you see this big crack here? All right, it's opened up because of the temperature extremes. And this is how we originally decked the boat, guys. All right, here's a seam right here but it's not open at all. And you can see we have a screw on this side of the seam, a screw on this side of the seam. We have a screw here, a screw here. Same thing up here. And that's how it originally was, nice and tight. And to bring you up to speed, when we brought this boat up from Florida, it had a vinyl deck on it. And we peeled it off and it had a lot of adhesive on the marine gray plywood original deck. And it was in great shape. Bert came up with the idea, why don't we, instead of spending days, maybe weeks, getting that adhesive off, what if we just skinned it with some exterior plywood? We could not get marine gray plywood up here. He said it'll probably last a couple of years. Well, he was right, okay? It's, it's not lasting that great. And I really think the way the boat is set up, we've got the brand new fencing on the craft, these beautiful cabinets from BoatOutfitters.com, beautiful vinyl seats in great condition. The top side of this boat looks like a million bucks, except the deck. And recently, we recarpeted a pontoon boat in Georgia with a product called Shaw Marine Carpet. It has a special R2X. I want to do the same thing. I want to get this thing really looking awesome. Now, we're also going to learn a lot more about pumps today with our friends from Johnson Pump. And guys, like always, the program is just going to be jam-packed full of tips and information. And speaking of those tips, here's today's very first one.